so today is the day before Halloween and we are going to be carving our pumpkins. Oh. <laughs> what happened? Where's your thing? Right there. You can't see it on the camera. No. Super cool. Mine looks really good on camera. Mine looks cool. Yeah, Alvin's looks cool too, but you just can't see it on the camera for some reason. Look. Can you see it on my phone? Mm. What a hat. There you go. I'm holding my phone. And then the camera behind it. It's like evil. Super cool. Best Good job, love. Good job on a castle. Thank you. So, Elvin and I just like the rides to um, the farmer's market here in Morgan Hill. So yeah, I think it rained last night, but and I'm glad it didn't rain this morning because we were able to take the bikes out. Super cute. I got a little padding for my seat, put on the rack. Elvin got a new rack. Oh, I can't see your bike. <laughs> He's blocking it. It's a nice bike. Yep. Ooh, that smells good. Yeah, dig in. So, we just rode our bikes down to the farmer's market. Yeah. And we got some tamales. Finn had to bundle in a little blanket and he has his sweater on. <laughs> this might be the last time that we're able to bike here. I know, right? All this is Pretty chilly today, anyway. What kind are these? Uh, one is pork and one is just jalapeno and cheese. Ooh, that sounds like my... Kind of style. Oh man, it's real. It has a banana leaf. Ooh. How come we're walking the bike? Ah, uh, because my pet my oops, I can't even hold this. <laughs> because my tire pops. Oh no. I don't know how or when, but I just felt like flat all of a sudden and then I looked back and my tire was like completely flat. Yeah. So, legging this dog, legging this bike. It's okay. We're like basically home. I think we rode maybe like oh, two, miles. two miles, which isn't far when you're biking at all, but it's kind of far when you got to lug this dog, this basket, this non-functioning bike. So we just got back from the store. I got this um, bike tube replacement. It was like six bucks, so pretty good. Now we just gotta take it off, replace the tube. Also, I got another wicker basket. I don't know if I need another one, but this is super cute and it was like, Really cheap, so I like it. Thank you. I think you're too little for that one, then. I mean, you're too big for that one. So fast. This is Alvin's new rack. This rack is actually not public. It's like a third-party rack, but it works pretty well. You can't fit there? You wanna try? Come here. Go ahead, go inside. Oh, you're too big. So, my sister and her boyfriend, Max, they just got a little puppy. His name is Ranger and he's a black lab. Um, I'm gonna see my sister today. I don't think I'm gonna meet Ranger, but I made him this little welcome home basket. Um, I actually used my Cricut to cut this out and then I ironed this onto um, a basket that I found at TJ Maxx. I think it turned out super cute actually. And it looks like, it's like velvety, so it's nice and soft. So I just got them a bunch of goodies. I think they, he, that he'll probably have a lot of like toys toys so I tried to get them other things but like this 
It looks like ruffles, which is super cute, so I couldn't help but get him that. It's like crinkly. Also, I like cute toys like this, but Finn doesn't really like playing with toys, so... Uh, give it... So... Yeah. Don't buy them that often. And then this is um, a toy that you put on the floor. And then you're supposed to put like toothpaste or tooth cleaning things on it or in between. And then the dog's teeth will get cleaned. Of course, it doesn't um, substitute for regular brushing. So there's also toothbrushes in there. I don't think this came with toothpaste though. I got her some poop bags and a dispenser. I'm sure she already has one, but I thought this one looked like super modern and cool. And um, you can never have too many of these. I got them some train me treats. Um, I actually use these to train Finn. I used to break them in half, but they are, I think these are already low calorie. Yeah, they're one and a half calories per treat, so you don't have to like worry about it too much if you are in a training session. You don't have to worry that they're getting too many treats. This is Finn's favorite, favorite treat. Um, it's Rachel Ray's new Trish. This one is just the turkey bacon recipe. Again, I like to just break those in little pieces. Um, when Finn was a puppy, I was so concerned about him being stimulated, especially in those kind of crucial, um, crucial ages. And right now he can't really be socialized, so I got him like a puzzle toy, I guess. So you hide treats and then he has to figure out how to get to them. Um, Finn and Allie had something similar to this one. I've been eyeing this one for a while, so it's pretty cool. This one twists. And then I got him kind of like a, I guess this is like a tug of war toy. And it also has the thing for his teeth so you can put like treats and stuff in there and he can try to get it. Then there's a big knot. He looks like he'll be a puller so that would probably be a fun toy. I got him a beef stick. I told my sister that rawhide is um, really popular but not good for your dogs because it's not that di digestible. So this one um, should be good. And then I got them this little beer can, super cute. Oop. I don't know if there's a squeaker in here. There you go. Yeah, so it's just a beer can um they had wine bottles too which i thought were cute but they looked kind of girly and he is a boy and then more functional things i got them a seat cover for their car so when they're transfer uh transporting him he um like won't mess up the seats or anything and then this one is cool because it has like pockets so you can put stuff in there and i hope this fits her car. I mean, I think these are supposed to be pretty universal. So as long as she has the headrest, which I think she does, I'm not 100% positive, um, it should work. And it's waterproof, so if they ever take him somewhere, he won't get his, uh, if they ever take him to a lake or something, he won't get the back seat all dirty. And then this, you can't really see it, but, um, it's a portable water bottle. My sister really likes hiking and going out. And if she's like me, she's probably going to bring Ranger to a lot of places. But um, it's just a regular water bottle. And then it has this flip out bowl, I guess you can call it. And then I'm not 100% positive, but I think this came with a seatbelt buckle. Um, I don't know if that's true or not. But if it did, then she can use the seatbelt buckle with the seat cover so that he can be nice and safe when they're traveling. And then I got, I gave him a bunch of pads. Always useful for a puppy, especially since he can't really uh, go potty outside since he doesn't have his shots yet. Um, I got this Nature's Miracle Cleaner 
comes in so handy with the puppy who's potty training and might have some accidents. And then I got her, or I didn't get her these, these I already have these. But I always have baby wipes on hand for Finn so that I can wipe his feet or if we go to the park, um, I'll clean him off really quick before he gets into the car. So yeah, that's everything. I hope she likes it. I'm so, so excited to give it to her. I hope they get good use out of it. Uh, yeah, gonna pack this up. Happy birthday, Alicia. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks? Where are we? Quay Park. For what? My birthday party. For my birthday okay. party. Alicia, you gotta be more hype. <laughs> it doesn't matter. What's Why? You gotta be too hype. Look, he's gonna go on the display. <laughs> Good job, SP. Yeah. Good job, SP. Good job. I made it! All right, so we're doing the hardest course. Just past some logs. Pretty, pretty high up. Whew, my arms are shaking. Tired. Dang, I think the sun is going down. Huh? The sun is going down, but I'm stuck in this little uh, thing right here. So, uh... Hopefully we can get out of this before the sun goes down because I can't see. Gotta climb through those rocks. Whew. 